Shooting in Phoenix, Arizona is having ripple effects right here in Bakersfield. Relatives of the family that was shot and killed by their son spoke today. 23 ABC's Ken Masenchi spent time with that family that lives here. Ken, just an awful story all around. Yeah, Tim, heartbroken is the only word to describe how two Bakersfield women are feeling after hearing Tuesday's news that five family members had died. Now a new obstacle, finding a way to get to Arizona for the funeral. I keep praying that I'll wake up from a nightmare and it'll be over. The harrowing nightmare is sadly more than just a dream. We are following breaking news out of Phoenix, Arizona. That's where police are on the scene. At a As 23 ABC brought you on Tuesday, a family of five all died after 26-year-old Alex Buckner shot four of his family members, father, mother, and two younger sisters, and set fire to the house. Police later found Buckner in a room and shot and killed him after he pointed his gun at authorities. Buckner's family says Buckner suffered from schizophrenia and recently decided to stop taking his medication. Here in Bakersfield, Buckner's grandmother and aunt are still trying to understand what happened. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. And I didn't even, I really didn't even comprehend it until it started showing up on, on the internet. And asking the daunting question. Why did you take all four? As a loving son, to hug him again ever. I talk to him. <laughs> as well as the two girls, one who was working and attending community college, the other a six-year-old. She was an angel for Halloween. <laughs> now she's an now angel. she's an angel. She's an angel in heaven. Now Beecher and Buckner face another challenge. Funding a trip to Arizona to say their goodbyes. We have to get there, take care of the business that we have to take care of, say our goodbyes, and then get just back here and come home. But they'll never be able to say goodbye to the memory of what happened. I know that for the rest of my life, this is going to be on my mind every single day. Learn more about Tuesday's events or to find out about the GoFundMe page that has been set up to help get the family to Arizona. Just head to our 23ABC News mobile and tablet app. In the newsroom, Ken Masenchi, 23ABC.